Well, well, well. I am back to the prologue. And hopefully this time we actually complete it. So yeah, we finished. Um, the, uh, I think he was called, uh, Homo Gorleo. <laughs> the legs, uh, boss. We, uh, beat his ass. And, yup, we are madam. So yeah, let's, uh, let's continue on and beat the shit out of that one dude who killed the king. The age king. Alright then. Stroll, of course his name. Grius. And she is called Gallica. Yup. Okay. Never in my life have I witnessed anything like that power you used. Tell me, is it some sort of magic? Actually, in terms of voices, I think I want to give him the Zavala voice. Like, something close to a Zavala voice. Because I love that voice so much. No, I suppose it couldn't can, can be. That was the igniters we were supplied with, at least. Yours was broken in the commission. Besides... <sighs> Incredible. <laughs> if only I'd had that kind of power back then. Apologies. I'm just thinking out loud. Today's been a trying... Today's been a... Shit, I cannot read. Today's been a tiring day. What? No, I'm... I, I don't read shit. This is just a typo. <laughs> it's tiring, not trying day. Is it what? Uh, okay, I guess I don't know. Let's get let's get some rest. What voice do I give this guy? You've done a fine job delivering that message, lad. It's finally time for us to act for His Highness. Ah, oh, you want to ask about that power, don't you? I had a question. <laughs> okay, that's straight up Zaval. I had a question of my own. You seem to know a great deal about the royal family. Before you infiltrated the army, who were you? Indeed, nothing but a mercenary. And yet, His Majesty gave me the honor of being His Highness, the Prince Tutor in Spoblay. The night of the attack, I was there. I see. Truly? That's incredible. Okay, uh, where the fuck do I go? No, Galica, I am not. Oh, campfire. <laughs> okay, I need to do something else for her. Okay, I think it's I think it's enough. I think it's enough bullying her voice like that. What was that power new? I wonder. Grius seemed to know something about it. Well, well, hey, I use it for what? I want to talk some more. No, let's get let's. I'm pooped. Okay, wow, great, great, Galica. That was really nice to like. Uh, that was really nice to know. Idol's Day and wait, we're still in Idol's Day. Can't sleep. Can't sleep. Surprised after what oh. we just went through. That was a decently long pause there, okay. Still, you've got to keep yourself rested to be at your best. I mean, to be honest, the ground makes a poor bed. <laughs> well, you're just gonna have to rough it until we're back to the capital. <laughs> He's such a pussy. I wanted to tell you, though, even though I made him say that, attacked, I heard a strange voice. Okay. It told me my duty would be to guide you. What do you think it meant? Well, guide me, woman. <laughs> I mean, I haven't exactly been much of a guide so far. <laughs> All I told Maybe? you was that we had to deliver our message, and that almost got you killed. Maybe because I never pressed triangles. Have you thought about that? <laughs> I never expected it would be this dangerous, and it feels kind of like it's my fault. Oh no, this is so... This is so fucking mean. Okay, no, no. I'm gonna be nice. You say that, but... Look. I can't fight with you. But... As long as you're up against all this scary stuff... I'll try to help however I can. You can't. Don't try it. Just just be there, okay? Comedic relief. Nice. <laughs> you something special, you know? I don't know what it is. <laughs> my dog. My dog. <laughs> yes. Oh, hey, uh, you know what insomnia is good for? Catching up on reading. What? Um, oh, God, she wants to read it again. God fucking damn it. Okay, here's some fucking... If our lives were anything like the world in your novel. It's just war after war here. With Magdalene in this book, it down. says, well, in World War II... <laughs> There was someone with a great mustache. That mustache, well, no one uses it now. For reasons. <laughs> but it's a nice fantasy. 
Enjoy it while you can. Am, am, am I okay? I mean, oh, okay, just drowsy, I guess. Ah, oh, the floor isn't so bad anymore, huh? <laughs> Bro, Stroll is fucking napping. He's napping as fuck right now. Grius <laughs> as well. That's a weird nap. I'm sorry. Uh, I would never be able to sleep like that. Eyes. Body. Hashirama. Anime, yes. Well, hello. Nice to meet no, you. No, not the cat. That's I've been waiting. <laughs> and now you've scratching a cat. That's always time. evil. Are you are you my Igor? You truly are an intriguing one. You seem much more handsome than Okay, no. There's no one more handsome than Igor. Look at that nose, bro. In the moment <laughs> when your heart is most gripped Unfamiliar by, man. I can I'm surprised you didn't say a man that looks like a painter or something. Do you paint? My name is Moore, and I'm wow. the humble author of the novel you've been reading. Wow. I got that. I've got to clap for that. Whoever the fuck named you Moore needs a raise. Wow. I mean, imagine during sex. And you want to call him out. You say more. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> imagine imagine if someone close to him is getting like... Well, raped. Let's say raped. And they're trying to call for him. They say more. <laughs> the rapist is gonna... Is gonna enjoy that. Like... More. <laughs> okay. This is such a fucking crazy... Uh... Example, so I'm gonna just shut the fuck up right now. You stand now in my study. Quite something, isn't it? A hall of wisdom, purpose built for the beast. How the fuck do you get here, right? Yup, yup. I call it academia. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Mr. Moore, these namings you have here are, are so fucking good, man. What's the deal? Who's naming you like this stuff? Tell me their name so I can like avenge you or something. <laughs> Alas, it's as much a prison as it is a library. His most merciful majesty saw What is his name? Bless. <laughs> it has me a bit addled, honestly. I no longer remember where in the kingdom my study actually lies. Alright. I never imagined my voice could reach beyond these walls. Until you appeared. And now, by whatever strange forces are afoot, I can speak directly to your mind. Do you perhaps live in Mexico? So, what would you say to an alliance? Only if I get a daily tackle. Like, hey, hey. <sighs> what kind of alliance? Is it uh, way over my head? Okay, okay. Um, you do realize my name is Madong, right? Are you okay with that? What kind of alliance? Kind okay. Of alliance. There must be more you wish to know. Instance, there must be more. The there must be more. Mr. Moore. Wow. Oh no, this game is gonna kill me. I believe you have found a way to reach true magic. You need no petty conduit of mortal make. You can even change your appearance using the raw magic oh. within. Oh. It is above all a mystic, long-hidden art. Now the stuff of legend. What I have come to call archetypes. Wow. Wow. Mr. Moore, I need to confess something. Why? <laughs> Why are you like this? <laughs> Why are you covering the statue's penis? Archetypes? Or are you the penis? Okay, a I. Uh... Of heroic virtue, a transformative power that manifests only in those who embody the heroes and kings of old in some core aspect. 
Heroes of antiquity are often depicted as near mythic figures with forms really? transcending okay. the mortal. These accounts are no mere allegory, but truth. However, none of my records describe anyone wielding such power as freely as you. Perhaps you are meant for not just proficiency, but mastery. Mm, okay, okay. In their truest form, archetypes represent the power of a true hero. One who can drive away calamity and evil in this world, no matter its form. Okay. Indulge me this request, and I believe my dream may yet be possible. Together, we can restore the kingdom's ideals. Alright. Deal. I shall gladly provide you knowledge and assistance to master your newfound power. So what say you? Will you take my hand in friendship? Oh, okay, uh, I was actually wondering if I can even refuse. But, uh... Okay. I, I actually want it. I, give, give, give it to me. All the loot, all the... All the more. The bargain is struck, then. From somewhere. Is your god called somewhere? The scholar in search of utopia. More. Within oh no. Him dwells the virtue of the seeker. The seeker. Who's the seeker? I bond with him, and a new power yet slumbering within thee may awaken. I am thou. Thou art I. Yes. Wow. Such a manly handshake. Wow. Story weave. Okay. Once again. Welcome to <laughs> Persona. <laughs> okay, good. I can sense the heroic embodiment of the seeker from more. Okay, and more is the first of your followers. People that support your quest as steadfast allies that you can grow closer to. Okay, let's see Persona, okay. I think I get it. We'll meet again, sure. I only played the first release of Persona 5. And wow, this is literally the same. <laughs> the royal funeral draws ever closer. Five, Five days, days remain. remain. Let's kill the whole. <gasps> Flames Day. So we have... First, Water's Day, Metal's Day, Idol's Day, Flame's Day. Okay, okay, we're starting to remember. Already then? Already then? From here on, we travel in secret. If we are to get back into the capital, we'll have to do it undetected. I mean, the clapping of my ass cheeks is so damn loud, I can't do that. So we'll cut through the forest, find the abandoned mine shaft in the mountain, and take the tunnel to the other side. That way, they'll never see us coming, huh? <laughs> they'll never see you coming! Oh, wow, okay. I need to stop. Glad you'll be our vanguard. <laughs> be a trial Madame! Fire. But the sooner you get used to that power, the better. By fire! Fire's day! <laughs> Speaking of, you were talking like you know something about it. Wait, it's flames day. Shit, not that fire day. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> not much. Just what I've picked up from missions in the early days. I've only heard it's a power found in those who walk a righteous path. Wow, what's the righteous path? It sounded like superstition to me, but everything's always clearer on the battlefield. Once I saw it in action, I could tell it was no fable. Hopefully, it has nothing to do with an egg with legs that one shot me. Like, never thought it'd come back to haunt me. Despite all my training and research, I never Zier. managed to master it myself. Huh. It really is something special. Huh? Yep. Don't forget. <laughs> wow, Stroll. <laughs> That's what you got from all this? Cut you down. There had to be something special about what he said. Like, one thing. Let's say it was special. And act like I actually know what he was saying. Yes, this is the way. I'm aware. Yep, yep, I'm totally with it. Believe me. <laughs> I heard everything you said. 
I'm watching you. <laughs> yes, I get it. Just trust me, all right? Right. Let's check the map. This will all be for nothing if we get lost. Ooh, okay. This place. They're called the Nord Mines, apparently. Going through them would put us near the capital, it seems. Okay, yeah. That being the case. This road should take us to the Grand Thread. Okay. Alright. We'll check for where are. Next stop, Grand Thread. Okay. This place, this place. The Nord Mines are full of complex paths. We can go through them to approach the capital undetected. Don't let your guard down. Where are we? Yeah, just, Good. just go. The Nord Mines, located northwest of Grand Trad. It is resource rich with magma crystals. Oh, well, I just realized we are a party of three right now. Nice. Now I'm gonna die less, at least. Stopped work in its traps. Exiting the forest, the party continues along the wooded road, leading to the derelict mine. The mines entrance should be just ahead. Don't try the, the path. Huh? What happened? That's not what I said, but, but okay. <laughs> I may be imagining it, but... Mm. I can't but feel we're being watched. No. Fuck. Already? Hmm, this deep in the world, though. Couldn't be. Sorry, I'm just on edge. Don't let your guard down. Looking for a to us, okay. Don't forget I have my eye on you. He literally came with us. Oh, we still have... <laughs> the... Knight armor. Oh, she is wearing it. Okay. Hey, look, up in the air. <sighs> Fucking birds. They're all from the government. Let's kill him. That large bird is known as a corvo. <laughs> okay. It stalks spray from the sky. Then goes in for an ambush. So... Ooh, what now? Like we need another addition to our list of problems. Maybe we can hide and wait it out? No. No. We need to keep moving. We're already low on time as... Just find them. Let's find them. Let me guess, you could move much faster if I died back there and you didn't need to keep an eye on me. Come on, have a little faith. Let's go. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. When we fought the gay lord, you kinda were shit. So I don't blame Grius if he is. Oh! Item! Glumos. Wow. I am so. So appreciative of Glumos. Hold on, there's some wild dogs over there. Hundos, the beast hunters. When they come and again, we'll be overwhelmed if we're not careful. Actually, I, I I spoke a bit wrong and sounded Italian and now I, I actually want to make Grius fully Italian so I'm gonna I'm gonna embrace the character we can't have <laughs> we can't give them the chance to surround us we need to find a different path for now why do you hesitate lad it's just a pack of a wild dog <laughs> barely with a moment don't worry when I'm someone that is you <laughs> really you still are gonna get it so be it. It seems you need an uh, uh, Im oh, fuck. impromptu lesson uh, on, the, on the basics of a combat. Pay attention uh, as the subject affords the new mistakes. First, take a good look at uh, your force. <laughs> Consider. Is this your first meeting or are you already familiar with them? 
Once you've asserted their strength, prepare your next move. If they are strong, approach them with caution. If they are weak, cut them down quickly. Now, says of the Honto, uh, what do you make of it? Uh, it's fucking pathetic. <laughs> Indeed, you stepped out of death scripts at the fort, so this should hardly be a challenge in red. <laughs> okay, game, just fuck me over. When you get to your weaker force, clear your mind and then simply do what must be done. Put them to a sword. Okay. Weaker enemies can be defeated quickly with a simple... Wow, so basically Dynasty Warriors this out. Wait, uh, uh, am I am I fucking reading tutorials? Let's go. Oh fuck. So let's kill this boy and let's kill boy. Boom, boom. No. Oh, I forgot about the sprint. Fuck them all. Wait, is there anything here? Yes, there is. Okay. Let's go. Ah, that's alright. Uh, one more rule for you to keep in mind. Got it. Never draw by your guard. Even against weaker foes. On the battlefield, uh, fortunes can turn a few lit up uh, for um, even a moment. Should that happen, change your tactics and uh, fight together as one. Stay calm and you'll be fine. Uh, okay, Grius, why the fuck are you Italian? <laughs> Wait, what gives me more XP? The squad battles or just fucking them over? Survey the situation and use a different method to fight. Never stop looking for ways to seize any tactical advantage. Okay, Mr. Italian Grius. Let's go. There's a replacement for first hand experience. Get a comfortable with uh, fighting before we uh, reach Grand Tetrad. I need to be sure you can defend yourself. Bro, did you see that fucking dancing gay lord? I beat the shit out of it. Cold. Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Death. Shit. That, th this bird is actually strong. Okay. Let's start it from the beginning. But what? What? I can restart it? Is this just a demo thing? Cause this sounds broken as fuck. Miss fucking dipshit. Wait, didn't he have two attacks? Does missing... ...makes him lose an attack? Okay. Wind! I think Bro really likes wind. We get 20 money from... A butterfly. Okay, I'm gonna take it. What is that? What is it? Someone saw you all out along those parts before. You wouldn't be bandits, now would you? Why the fuck are you, is your voice like this? You don't think I look like a bandit? Oh hell, oh, I'm not a bandit. I suppose you're not crooks. Hmm. Bro, look at our drip. What crook? We're already the mafia boss. Look at Stroll. Look at his shoulders. These can't stab people. I guess I'm just an edge. Oh, wow, this game really loves edging. Why? I know it's funny to think so in a deserted place like this, but I feel like I'm being followed. Oh. Oh, wait. Didn't this chapter start... I say chapter, this is all prologue, by the way. But didn't it start um, with an eye looking at us? I'm guessing that's the next big monster. Just someone who has a giant eye seeing everything at all times. What are you doing at such a remote place? What? I'm not an enemy, man. I'm just a peddler. I'm a regular nearby, so I keep business. But the beasts are real blood resty, so that's why I'm just so mad for you, Mirabit. Okay. For instance, have you heard about the human rapids from now on and wipes out in three times the family? No! <laughs> what? What? That's such a weird hobby. 
<laughs> Let me. I'm thinking. My apologies didn't mean to sound the mood. Oh, hey. What do you mean? Not the mood. It's was taken in my mind. Oh, you have find something for saying? I can give it. Well, I didn't buy it. Plenty of good stuff in this world. Lots of rubbish. But some materials too. You won't catch me scavenging for it today, Paul. Thank you. Ah, it's fine too. <laughs> I'll step it into the beast setting down. You find something worth saying. Well, you know where to find me. Nice, level 5. And let's go. We are still going the explosion round. Oh, okay. Hey, what's wrong? We've been surrounded. Even out here, uh, we, to we, des <laughs> we deceive uh, that uh, the monasteries are at the least of our concern. <laughs> Bro, his whole voice changed. He was like epic. I know. And now he's just. I know you can hear me. <laughs> so show yourself. Or would you rather be weak about you? Oh, it was. You? Damn, overly sharp for an old goot. Aren't ya? The bastards lived long enough. Kill him quick. <laughs> I love this voice, okay. It appears we must do this. I've never fought soldiers before. But I won't waver. <laughs> Do you want to wait for chocolates? Uh, kill me. Wind. Wind. Wow. Okay. What is that? Never seen anything like it. That's not an igniter. Take this. This is called go fuck yourself. Okay, Madong. Why Madong? Guard, this is gonna be really great. Let's, uh. Let's guard. Wow, 40. I still died. <laughs> I love. <laughs> okay, you think this is. Galka is just fucking. The fuck are you guys doing? Well, um, yep, we got our asses uh, given to us by nameless <laughs> humans. <laughs> okay, how much HP do I have now? If I knew, I would have healed myself at least. What? This bird. Come here, bird. Kill him. Good. Now we can focus this motherfucker who does not fucking die. Holy shit, he's fucking tanky. I know it's because he's on the back roll. But still. No! I, I guess, okay. Oh, I got medicine. <laughs> okay. Are they as well just for the fort? They survived, but no, but they couldn't be a. They simply deserve this, aren't they? No. That's not what I'm asking. How would they have already mobilized a pursuit? I don't know, but I think it's safe to say I'm the least of your priorities at this point. Let's hurry. In any case, we should probably head moving. Let's go. Alright. Here we are. It looks so creepy. Well, I guess you did say it was abandoned. Hey, <laughs> the crowd at the Eucracy, or the Teto. I haven't been to this place in quite a some time. Despite the royal decree, I am still hear of uh, miners risking it all to come to this place. Seeking the riches <laughs> left with him. I'll help him treat some illegal. <laughs> okay, this is just straight up the ball at this point. Okay, I'll just uh, fully embrace it. I'll happily 
treat some illegally migrants for the armed detachments of soldiers, presuming us. Shall we hurry inside? You're not wrong there. Make a preparations, if you must, but be quick about it. Okay, you motherfucker. I, I get it, I get it. Come give me your fucking... Call the business in the bottom of Wow, the right man of all places, is there someone you know in sight? <laughs> True. How about you heard? This place was abandoned. A few blokes stayed up behind and to do some less than legal mining. Oh, okay. One of them is an old friend of mine. I sell the stones he digs out. But tell him about that. Surely we met for a reason. So if there is something you need, allow me to accommodate you. Oh, is that? Okay. I think it's safe to say this is the best option. <laughs> we'll buy it all. Thank you, Phil. We come back in time. I kinda already know what you're thinking, so let's get in. There's probably a bunch of shady miners in there, right? Will we be safe out there? <sighs> Doesn't matter, we kill them. Fear or not, most of them are the same miners who worked here before the closure, besides. It would be against their best interest to cause a scene and risk the crown theocracy <laughs> coming down on this place, right? Oh, sounds like there won't be a problem. Already? Yeah. If I were to pursue to catch up with, uh, with us, it'll be a whole mess of trouble uh, that I'd rather not deal with. Let's uh, move with the haste. <laughs> wow, you're really hasty. Okay. Nord Mines. Okay. However, It's the quiet. Are you sure there are still people working here? That is this quitting stillness you feel. Those are your instincts alerting you to the bloodthirst in the air, uh, judging by the people who were after us before. Then it's likely. Stop. Don't move. <laughs> okay. Don't you dare move. Time to kill more people. You're trapped like rats now. <laughs> Lay down your arms and surrender peacefully. <laughs> As I thought, we walked into an ambush. They've got a certain advantage. Catch us in this narrow bottleneck. <laughs> we need to turn the back now. That's now yours. The intestines already been tainted with sandwiches. I don't know why they're so sussy. So do immediately. You've got nowhere to run. And if you don't comply, <laughs> the demanders will pay the price for your answers. Oh, okay. This is a misunderstanding. We're not deserters. We were forced to retreat. We had no choice. A human. Oh yes. We were aware of your predicament. That's exactly why we can't have any survivors. I mean, oh, this. I turn that near any strength. How the fuck am I doing that voice? Well, it appears that we have stepped in our consequences. This is a fucking circus. Everyone has this fucking weird voice. We have no choice. We fight our way out. Here they can't stop them here now. Come. Boom, boom. Oh shit. All that for this? Over there, someone's collapsed. Oh god, what voice do I give him? Hey, are you alright? Oh okay, voice acted nice. So is bloody hell. Don't kill me. <sighs> okay, wow. What? Why? To send a message, boy. Either we give ourselves up, or these innocents pay the price. But the only one who could know we survived. 
and the only one who could send soldiers after us. Oh, come on, let's move. Okay, Saul definitely lost something. He has been like this for a while now. What? Is that? Just as I thought, it all makes sense now. It appears that we'd expect it. Okay, is the eyeball here? Oh. <gasps> no. I knew Please, I no. Free. Not the fat man. Anything but the fat man. He's glorious. You were the only one who never went up to the fort itself, after all. It couldn't have been anyone else. Who would have thought three sorry stragglers would make it past a whole unit of assassins? Bastard. You never intended for anyone to well, survive. Well, I mean, you it was kind of obvious he's a bad guy. <laughs> I was just <laughs> praising him for no reason. Naturally. You heard the reports. I only put more bait on the hook. Though I wasn't expecting that damn thing to be rampaging already. You sent those soldiers to their deaths. Why? Why not? Because the Kingdom's Guard is powerless before the humans, and only a pile of bodies will prove that to the public. So someone wants the King's Guard disgraced. And when the people need him most, a savior rises as their shield. Is that your game? <laughs> Kinda solid. <laughs> savior? Speak plain, boy. You think he's one of Luis's men? Oh. A pitiful flock needs its shepherd. If a little blood is what it takes to show them who their real savior is, then that's a price easily paid. Alright. Your term is kind of bad, I guess. That's why those sons and daughters die. For your savior. <laughs> they aren't the first. The soldiers cry for reinforcements. The villagers plead to be spared. But I know better than to confront a human. Okay. A, a village. You refused. Wait, then you were the one who... Well... Shit. <laughs> Seven years ago, the first flames day of June, a village in the northern hills was razed to the ground. A village called Harlia. Um, yeah. Oh, yes, that might have been a name. <laughs> Why is he so why is he so confident and not interested this much he has to be some kind of weird creature hiding inside I just fucking realized this man has horns uh, there's nowhere that's headgear how the fuck do you wear that these are fucking horns oh shit uh, I say that and I just take one look at stroll and I see horns. Okay, never mind. <laughs> you left one survivor. <laughs> All this theories just to absolutely get slapped in the face for it. Oh, we're fighting him. We're fighting Fat Man. Surely he has like infinite HP. Stay back. Who the Help fuck me. is that? <laughs> you played right into our Help hands, me. Why does he sound like that? Was that was such a light <laughs> push. A You're a disgrace to your title. I may not make it out alive, but as for oh, you, it's time for him. Yes, please, please, yes. Oh my God, yes. I was waiting for this. Yes. I thought she said lobster, but okay. Yes, please. What? 
You've got your strength. Wait, he also has it? You call this real? Leaders abandon their people and the innocent die by their scorn. If that's the real world, then it can die alongside you. Holy shit, okay. Okay. My family were taken from me. I am the last of my house. I am the last of my noble bloodline. And in the name of my people, I will strike you down where you stand. Oh, what the? F By the way, I did see an elf right there. I didn't miss her. God, yes, he's so cool. What the fuck is it this? <laughs> Wait. He's got power like yours now? Well, better show him how to use it. I don't know what you think you're doing, but I'll not cave to an empty threat like that. What empty threat? Did you fucking see how he transformed? Bro, he pulled his heart out and revived all the dead people alongside them an elf and basically said he's gonna kill you. What empty threat. This ignite is all I need to turn you to Ash. You lot, get to it. Ash Ketchum? So he scampers off to protect himself, and his subordinates get to be his living shields. The man's showing his true colors. I'll fix the filthy coward with the end he deserves. The ignite nice. is powerful, but it takes care and calculation to wield. If you sense danger, Steal your defenses and endure it. Oh no, I can use him. I'll cut you down. <gasps> Wait, what? The freedom of a wanderer. <laughs> of course they buff him. Of course they buff him. Get fucked. <laughs> he's so fucking weak, by the way. I'm guessing there's a phase two to this. Damn, he's fat as fuck. 69? No, no, no. You cannot do that to me. Don't hit me. Oh my god. He's focusing me so much. No, please. Stop hitting me. No, no. I'm actually gonna die. Fuck you. Oh, please. Okay, maybe just 50 HP isn't actually that good. <laughs> but... Full send it. Yes, go fuck yourself. <laughs> okay, what a, what an absolute beautiful run. Never expected a commissioned officer would end up a wild-eyed zealot. How how did I do all that? And without an igniter, just like him. Magic. Who are you? Madil. But how? I'm Leon Strong. No, let me let me know let me name you something. Give me the option to name you. I will make sure your name is amazing. Back there, Klinger mentioned a village that was raised by a human. They sent for help. But he abandoned them. Halia was its name. I'm the son of its lord. And now I know what All right. happened. We sent our fastest riders, but we were doomed from the start. If Luis was behind it, then that's all I need to know. He's the one who will answer for it. I have a feeling he doesn't get at all. I don't want to be an ally of convenience alone, so once more, please. Let me join your cause. Bro, we're friends. Remember? We're friends. 
I don't care what Gris says. We're friends. Bro, just because you don't have one doesn't mean you should be grumpy about it. So you've no objections. What say you, friend? Yes, you you said it. You said it. We're brothers. Brothers in arms, my friend. Yes, bro. Brothers in. Uh, yes. I'll do my best to deserve that honor. Now, onward. The proud noble. Strong. Within him dwells the virtue of the warrior. Nurture thy bond with him. And a new oh, okay, okay. I am now. That <laughs> I need to stop this comparison. The manly, yes. I'm waiting to uh, find a, a, a bond with a woman. So I see the manly handshake <laughs> when a woman does it. Did you feel that just now? What's going on? Does it have something to do with that odd magic? <laughs> yeah, what's going on? When does the sex start? We're having a threesome right here, a manly threesome. Now that I think about it... Get away, Galica. You're not invited. Isn't it weird You're too small anyway. <laughs> I mean, come on. What does this mean? Actually, never mind. I've seen the boys and I've seen what small people can do. Still no. Flashbanged. Freaking curling again. The Eye Man. Hey, oh. Where are we? What just happened? <laughs> I want you to meet my very interesting friend. He's called Moore. Surprising indeed. Somehow you find yourself here once more. <laughs> once more. <laughs> Oh my god, I fucking hate you so much. And a fairy. I thought their kind long extinct. Do they yet take refuge in the Elden Sanctum? What? Hey, you gonna talk to me or just at me? <laughs> we meet again, my friend. expected. Remarkably, another has awakened. What miracle is this? Yes. That same power now stirs in your companion, another of the mighty archetypes. Do you recall oh, yeah. earlier about how archetypes are an original form of magic? Oh no, don't... <laughs> uh... Why? Why do we have to do this? I'm sorry for making a lot of personal jokes. I'm sorry, so please game, stop the more jokes. <laughs> I get it. I get it. He's called more. I get it. <laughs> well, more or less. Consider this. As an elder, you are an outcast of society, yes? Your very identity is a kind of destiny you may defy but not escape. I think more people know that I'm an elder then they know that Christianity exists. All mortals suffer under the weight of our burdens. But in facing and embracing that anxiety, you make it your innermost power. You find freedom. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so, the lives of those who overcome their hardships and embody the virtues within are passed down as heroic tales. Sure, Your sure. Your companion too had his eyes open to his true path and claimed its virtue. That awakening is your doing, you know. He awakened to the archetype that protects you. <laughs> hey, hold on a second. Who even he can't hold on. He only says more. I'm warning you. If you mess with him, you're gonna have to go through me. Ah, you two share quite a deep connection, don't you? Well... <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna well, say it. We didn't always, <laughs> but now we're partners to the end. We're linked down to the depths of our hearts. Right? Right, Madong. I mean, my name means a lot of stuff, but a dong it is. And I know that I share a very amazing relationship with my dong, so I agree with you with this one. Right. Wait, what were we talking about again? We trust each other. I've got his back and he's got mine. And that's all there Pause. is to it. 
Of course, mage. Mage? Okay, mage. Surely he has like, she, like, one HP. She can't be like, tanky. Unless, like, you know, <laughs> the keeper of the party. But you can still benefit from her. Like, uh, I remember, was Futaba like this from Persona? Oh my god, she's also orange haired. It all makes sense. <laughs> and I have way made another persona comparison once again. Alright. Orange hair. Just on the side, I guess. Fascinating. Fascinating. Do you understand what just happened? By connecting with others who have found their resolve, you awaken to new Yeah, I know, I I'm I'm kinda really you know, uh, speedrunning that part. <laughs> and further, you and all this is the, the prologue, right? With the strength of any archetype in your circle. As an example, your other companion, the fellow with the eye patch, he oh. seems to have some training and knowledge regarding the wielding of an archetype. Okay. By his own account, nothing came of it. Yet, if you so desire it, you can awaken the true power within him. All right. Uh, I kind of already knew that, but okay. Rias could use this power too. The nature of the please, please. He's kind of useless in battle. Perhaps it is simply your own nature. You truly are remarkable. If you seek answers, he's just very tanky. That's that. all. I want to kill people fast. That's what it means to be useful. Finally, we get to this page. Let's see. What voice do I give this motherfucker? Uh. <laughs> Firstly. Let us consider the one-eyed warrior who yet bears no architect. Open Grius's link, cut, please. Okay. This is the chart that allows the power and connection of the actives. You can gain a new act by selecting one here and studying its powers. Okay. To that, you will need Magla. What the fuck is Magla? The source of all magic. But simply drawing from the Magla within yourself will put too heavy a burden on you. What this means you is you will need to gather mag magazine from your battles and other sources. Keep that in mind as you travel. To learn is to change oneself. They say here, you may achieve that through study of the archetypes and their deepest secrets. Now then. Now, I like you to choose an archetype from among days. I mean, where is Troll? Where was Troll? This is Troll, right? Ah, this would be the archetype that young nobleman recently awakened to. The warrior's domain in physical offense. Yes, yes, please. By the way of a weighted grace world, few other archetypes can compete with its raw destructive power. Yet that specialization comes at a cost. It has virtually no utility or support outside of hard heads. That's all I need, bro. Just hit heart. Fist heart. Finger, I mean... If you aim to... Why the fuck are you talking about this, by the way? This is very inappropriate. Okay. Settle your penis, please. If your aim is to overwhelm the enemy with, with brute force, I'd say this is a fan act to do it with. You know me well. This is the one. 500 mag is required to channel the warrior. This is the act that you've chosen? Yes, yes, yes. Wait, wait, actually. <laughs> I wanted to see Galica. I didn't see her <laughs> yet. I don't know what she does. I mean, she, because, you know, she's not in the party, so she's completely safe at all times. So I wanted to know if I can benefit from her. Of course. Next time, next time. So be it. Following you and the young man called Straw, another worthy world of the archetypes joins your Yangs. Yangs? Yangs. From the sanctum, I shall speak to the heart of the man with the archbat. Grias. Feel his result. And let a new soul dwell in his hand. Okay. What the fuck? Oh 
What? I hear the voices of fast hero souls. Fuck you! God the fucking damn it! Why the fuck are you so cow? My armor was literally made of paper. That motherfucker, Mr. Moore, they lied to me. Ha ha ha. Okay, that, that was the weird voices I'm hearing. Oh, worthy hat. Who tempers anxiety into stings. Of thou art the I am out on it. I am <laughs> ready to bear thy safe. Okay, this is actually a lot of fucking nothing burger. Okay. What the fuck's happening by the way? I have no idea what the fuck we're doing. This is the same magic I once stole for. I cannot believe it's finally in my grasp. Wait, so I still have my Huh? Wait a second, so basically now both Stroll and Grius can use it, or what? Uh, uh, what am I missing? By the way, I still have Mag, right? Enough for, uh, you know, uh, the Gallica mage thing. That man with the abage should now have a walk into an act app. Similarly, I can imbue you with that noble youth of, uh, with a new act app power. Be free to experiment. Now and from here on. Okay, so, oh, I can unlock something, but no, no, no let's check, uh, mage. I Do I have enough mag? The mid. This is an act type you sensed from Galaga, way of life. Its heroic embodiment is that of a good teacher who manipulates the force of magic at will and performs miracles in the name of the one who he lives. What? All right. Have any mag? Hmm? Please? Okay, uh, I'm not really sure what she does, but yes, I want to trust. What? Okay, I'm, I'm super confused. How are Grius be benefiting from this, by the way? Like, am I just inserting powers in him? Or so? I I'm so confused. There's a very tat. A shared resolve and honored crate. <laughs> Taking you for as a mate. Okay, so basically now he has both, right? We are the neighbor to all the terrain. Okay. Channel the mage archetype? Huh? Okay, uh, uh, am I switching or like, am I replacing or just switching or something? Uh, uh, no? <laughs> I'm so confused right now. Just get me out of here. Oh, I forgot about this selection menu. This makes much more sense. Yeah, I kind of fucked up, right? Yeah, I definitely kind of fucked up. My dog. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. All right, I see. So basically, we're giving each person we're we're buying them a new uh, a new persona, so they can use. This is literally ego. Yes, cat. That's a good kitty. <laughs> this cat, you see. Cute, isn't it? An Indian plateau. Why the fuck would you name your cat like that? Why? What kind of name right? Is it? Oh. He's the one only solace I, I have as I'm confined here. Why are you confined here? Oh. I almost read that hero's incest, but okay. Oh, it looks like he's taking a shine to you. That's a valuable item. So do hold on to it. The cat gave me something? Okay, I guess. Mystical scrolls, the royal magic, <gasps> the royal scepter, please. That's a formula for a rather complex spell. When mages advise such intricate magic, they commit the formula to a scroll in advance. Huh? Hold on, are you saying the king himself wrote this? What would it be here? For? Why would it be here of all places? My name is Mar. Uh, why are you not? Appreciating my name. If I say more, people give me more. I could be, I could begin to tell. Perhaps the previous king had his reasons for prince. Oh wait, you have a backstory, don't, don't you? Huh? Now I'm interested. I would laugh at Cypress can't, but it will take a good amount of time. So basically, you're lazy. Okay. It's written in a script I've never laid eyes on before. Learn it. Bitch, you're literally here, <laughs> doing nothing other than, well, learning something apparently. But before you go, there's just one thing. Would you mind taking a look 
at the very end of the scroll. What's this? Okay, I'm not sure what I'm looking at. It looks like shitty AI art. So, <laughs> I, I think the royal scepter, I mean the royal gods thing, men, kings, are just, we're just pranking you, I guess. Take a look. What? <laughs> the fuck are you saying? <laughs> no, 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 there's no way, no way. Indeed, it's no more than a simple illustration. I mean, this is not simple, I guess. But do you not think it bears some resemblance to the secret act? Moreover, it bears a caption, and mysteriously enough, of all the language theory. That is the one part I am able to pass. It says rib. <laughs> oh, no, no way, no fucking way. I almost thought that was like legit and not using the variable I gave them. That would have been so fucking funny. It says Repetazio. Wow, what a name! Wow, I am so intrigued by this. The Repetazio. Likely the name of a person. <laughs> Unmistakably so. Though I could not begin to tell you why I feel so sad. Let me tell you something more. Fuck you, why is your name like that? A person's name. Yes, Madong. It is me, Madong. It is Ribatazio. Yaisio. Hang on a second. Well, well, that's certainly a mystery on top of an enigma. Makes me wonder if what it says. You would never guess. You would not believe what it says. Should you learn anything new, I would appreciate it very much if you share it with me. Please examine the scroll whenever you've learned new truths. Shouldn't we show him my book? I mean, it looks kind of small. Surely he can, he can like, finish it in one day. He, apparently he's reading a much bigger book right now while talking to me. Okay, I'm kind of done with this shit. Uh, how the fuck do I open door? My own okay. truly as remarkable as I first Let me speak. Others fated to awaken to their own power will be naturally drawn to you. To reach the lineage of power's greatest potential, you must acquire more archetypes and bring them together. After all, sure. a hero without allies is nothing more than a lone dissenter. To save the many, you must learn to fight with the power of many. Okay. Only a champion of the people may awaken the power of heroes, and with it, seize a future of their own making. You clearly have not played Black Mythukon. Have you seen Pluck of Many? I don't need a lot of other people. I just need a lot of myself. <laughs> when next you come to see me, I hope it shall be of your own volition. Open my book, then let your imagination come. Wait, you are the book? As vividly as you can make it. I'm sure that will be enough to reunite us. As long as you walk the okay. path, I shall faithfully watch over you. May we meet again. Please no. Please, please no. I don't want to see your face ever again. Mr. Moore. <laughs> the way he just gets out quickly. <laughs> I can't. I can't keep doing this shit. <laughs> Look at his face. What? This motherfucker. He did this again. You two all right there? Looked as if you were in some kind of trance. Trance? Wait. Have we been here this whole time? Oh. It was strange. Oh. As if I felt something in the air. Yes, I kind of buffed you a lot. Accidentally. <laughs> and I kind of regret it right now. Magic. What? So that wasn't a dream. Grius, that's probably his power. Yes, it's the power of my dong, Grius. Do you like that? You studied back at the Sanctum, right? I know you couldn't get the hang of it then, but I think we might have just awakened it. Okay. Um, I'm still kind of confused on that whole thing. Awakened it? But that's... Who are you people? 
the truth if you would. <laughs> Look, in all honesty, we barely know any more than you do. But the short version is Cool, well, so I'm not the only one. I think you can use that power now. Uh, I think you might be right. The way it feels is well, this is magic, eh? <laughs> and all but given up on it, but fate had other plans, it seems. Enough. We must move on. There is far to go still. And lad, I follow <laughs> your lead now, at least when it comes to use these skills in battle. We haven't the luxury of time to train with magic. Same here. You've clearly got a sense for this, and I'd rather make myself useful than muddle your strategies. All right. We've five days until the funeral. That's precious little time, and we'd best not waste it. By the way, are we sure this is still the prologue? <laughs> Ghost man. <laughs> More's right there. More? Wow, okay, he didn't joke about it. Cool. Thank you, game. So no one else really sees him. Hmm. Maybe we're the only ones who can go to that room. Oi. Oh. 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 <laughs> Are you not alright? What the fuck? Oh, it's you. Pardon? I saw that banner on the same that we do this. <laughs> what business would they have in a place like this? Hold on, don't tell me they're after the miners. Hold on. Wait. How did you get in here? I'm certain the entrance and exit were sealed off by soldiers. Is he like the final boss? Accidentally? Secretly? Soldiers? I didn't see any, anyone. What the fuck are you talking about? Only one I saw was that pasty fellow who looked like some kind of general. Oh. You mean fat man? But we left him splayed out of the, over there. Well. Me. We must go up to him. I mean, he's he's a very fucking fat pig, so uh, I'm very fucking sure we can catch up to him in no time. Leave him, him be. I don't know why I'm why I'm saying this, because uh, it kind of sounds like a really really bad idea. But uh, he has no one else left. I wager uh, he was bluffing about sealing off the exits. What makes you say that? I don't know for that. Uh, he failed to finish us off. He want to be able to return to Louise or Nate, think about the disgrace. O okay. Still, he could do other worse shit. You're right, let's leave him. <laughs> wow, wow. Surely this is not gonna fucking fuck us in the ass later. I have no idea why this is the all about, but I'm relieved. I was worried everyone would be dead in here. Bro, I barely know you and you're worried about me. You're kinda actually nice. But I kinda don't care. <laughs> I'm going to be around for a while, so if you need anything, you know how to ask. Yes, wink wink, give me money, please. <laughs> the protagonist and Gallic, wow. It's called Madong, can't see more in dungeons and, or towns. Okay, fucking more. Yes, I know, I kinda know what you're gonna do. <laughs> oh, that was nearly it for me. Sorry you got dragged to all of this. Most of the good soldiers are into unhinged maniacs, if it helps. Right, considering you apologizing, I guess you aren't the bad guys. I see why a clinger is stooped to use the hostages as a bait. A worthless accompaniment, but he certainly had an eye for a new recruit. A surefire tactic against your like. By the way, what's the narrative about you being Italian? Why the fuck are you speaking like this? Anyway, I am hurtly ashamed. That aside, I, you're not passing through these caves, are you? You'd best turn back now, so. Something nasty in the air lately. Uh, they claim to noses jiggling around here. They're not just little jellies anymore, they're downright dangerous. Wow, we're fighting slimes. I'm like chasing them away, but a blade doesn't do much. God fucking damn it. I literally just bought a blade. Fire. Okay. Clearly, I cannot do shit with wind. So, hopefully, uh, the other two can do something about it. Oh, or an igniter. Okay, good, good. So, basically, everyone can beat the shit out of them. They're used to be 
see too many of them around, but there's no many we might never clear them out. So, uh, this is places that are right most of them for the uh, days. Uh, all I'm saying is it's a long way to the others and all I'm saying is, it's a long way to the other end of the mountain. No man can get through that and skip. But... The king is a few owner is upon us. We haven't the time to look for the route. Yeah. Not much else we can do. Then. We... Not, not, much, not much else we can do then. But we should at least make sure we can use some magic. I already did that. Alright, let's get going. Let's be the shit out of everyone. Fuck you, I have no interest in speaking with a fucking commoner. Right, a uh, stroll. What the fuck did you say? What are these? This uncanny feeling in the air. This place. The magla here feels awfully dense too. Was it always like this? It was an odd. This used to be a completely mundane mine shaft, no different from the others. Perhaps this is what the miner was talking about before. Something about the interior of this place being unusual. Assassinating Louise is our top priority. Do not forget that. Prepare yourself now, for we'll have no time to rest until we've we're through here. Mind their numbers and watch your health carefully. We hear. Okay, let's beat the shit out of them. Oh, it's two. Fuck. Bro, you literally have balls in your chin. Let's go. Come on. Just a toit. If you can beat up Homog or Leo, you can definitely just destroy this. And just hope that the rest doesn't kill you. <laughs> That's not all either. I'm sensing Mag. And the feeling only gets things stronger. It's disturbing, like back at the fort. Don't tell me. Okay, yep. See, it's the fort. Surely you don't mean fear is a luxury we can't afford right now, lad. Gallica's words are cause for a concern, but for now we need to keep moving. Look closely, lad. There's a cup between those collabs, the rock. Yeah, it's almost like I never saw it, right? We should be able to squeeze through. I mean, you don't need to squeeze. Especially you. Hey, see that rope over there? The Maglev is less dense there compared to the rest of this place. Oh, safe room. And it's too. I don't feel anything. I thought it was just a feeling, but... Now I can see it. It's like the Maglev hollow out just for that room. Back in the sanctum, I learned that fairies are natural adepts at sensing magla. It's a safe to assume that Gallica is no exception. Maybe we can get some rest in there. Why don't we head inside? Indeed. That is not a bad idea. We should catch our breath before continuing. It doesn't really seem like an ideal place to rest. <laughs> I'm just wondering why the Magla is thinner here. Like, uh, this is absolutely shit. I, uh, I'm noble. Did you forget that? Bro, I couldn't tell you much. It's like, uh, it's just like a feeling I get. There's a, ver uh, there's a varying de density in the Magla that floats around through the air. For example, uh, think of it like a steam or a uh, It seems uh, not that much I could seep into this room, a, a Magla hollow. If you will. Even your igniters w won't work as well in here. Hmm. The Magla Hollow seems as good as term as any, and all the better if Gallica can sense them. You could say that. It's easier to spot a big absence of Magla when the area around it is flooded with the staff. The beast is similar to, uh, to approach uh, as well. Let's catch our breath here while we can. Nice. So basically a safe point. Yep. We've played for almost four hours, and wait, wait, wait. it doesn't say if this is still prologue. This, this is the prologue. <laughs> How the fuck is this still prologue, by the way? Uh, resume exploring. I don't have anything to do. I wish we could buy some medicine in here, but sure, I guess. Wait, do enemies respawn? Fuck. If I remember correctly, I think in persona the enemies respawn. 
Oh, he's right here. Cool. Come here, bitch. Come on. Okay, I assume this is the boss, right? Let's go. Wait, wait. Something feels really wrong further than here. It might be what I was sensing. Unfortunately, we got no choice but to pray soon. Regardless of what lies ahead. Got it. I'm going to open it. Are you ready? Yes. All right. Good to hear. Let's go. Wahoo! <laughs> I still don't know why he's Italian. What the fuck is that? I mean, after playing Black Myth Wukong, this is actually not that weird. What is that? I've never seen anything like it. It's a crystal. You've seen weirder. Please see sure Homo Garleo's weirder. Now I remember. They say in the lands beyond mortal reach, great spires of crystal stand. And anyone who might touch them is driven mad. That's all just superstition. Oh. Still, this thing is giving off a really nasty aura. That's no ordinary <laughs> monster. Some kind of human? The way it's moving, it's almost like it's protecting the crystal. Here it comes. <laughs> okay. Let's see his name. You're not as massive as I thought. No holding back, come on. Oh god, these are my damn skills, by the way. Wow. Wow. One shot, huh? Will your tail end here? I see how it is. I see how it is. This is absolutely... This is fucking crazy. Yup, it's absolutely useless. Uh... What are they expecting from you in this, like, stage of the game? With the amount of enemies they throw at you. Like, what? Is it because I threw all my stats on attack? Oh, how the fuck? Okay, no, 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 this is absolutely disgusting. Oh, fuck. Shit. Great. Great. Hyper. Front roll. Okay. Stupid voice. I swear to god if I actually lose here After all this Okay, fuck Please die Fuck, fuck, don't be super powerful Good, good, good My last actual good medicine. What? 71? Just for a fucking light attack? Okay. Clearly we should not buff our allies. If I actually attacked those first couple of rounds with Madong, this would have been cleared. You still have the powerful strike? Uh oh Okay, good, good, good. He's still alive. Greece is the most important one here. Finally. God fucking damn it. The problem is that I did the right plan. And it didn't even work the way I wanted it. But it still worked. <laughs> so I guess, yeah, sure. Why? Why are they increasing it without my consent can i retract attributes is that possible so i can make my dong absolutely crazy in damage by my guess the monsters were drawn to its aura they shouldn't leave something so sinister just lying around
Nice. All questions and answers, but there's no time to ponder them. We better move. You can't be serious. Wait a second. There is no way there is more. No way there is a uh, more boss fights. This makes sense. Okay, okay, and he's like 15. So to get the same damage, I need to get my strength to 15. Okay, it all... By the way, wh why is she here? I just realized. Here. This makes much more sense. Okay, Stroll is just built different. He's just the one. He's him. Hopefully my MP lasts for whatever this game is hiding from me. Because that boss took a lot of MP to kill. Oh my god, there is no fucking way. What the fuck? Oh! The Great Sword kills them. Okay. Didn't know that. No. No, there's no fucking way there's a bigger... Oh my god. Oh my god. No fucking way. Not a something I'd hope to, uh, to ever stample upon. I'm afraid that's a dragon. Wow. Dragon? You mean those creatures from the legends? I've never seen one with my own eyes. I mean, aren't you from a legend too? Now I understand why the mine was closed. They must have tagged right into this thing's roost and had no choice but to back off. Wait, so we don't need to fight it, right? Yup, yup, yup. We don't need to fight it. This mine taps at magnificent vein of resources. Only something as terrible as the dragon could have forced them to abandon such a lucrative operative. Look on our side as we've caught it slumbering. Like this. We can slip past it and continue forward. Please, yes. Almost a shame, it has all sorts of things. It's little, well, big nest. Yeah, she likes gems and stuff. I can say something tint with magla too. Oh, okay. <gasps> Wait, what? Dragons are ancient and strong magla for fellows in their wake. Just the way it goes. Uh, any so-called special item you're sensing? Oh my god, okay game. Fuck you, game. You know I'm gonna do it. Yup. Yup. You're making it feel sad. <laughs> It's that kind of appealing. But we're sure to end up in a fight if we die to take it. Don't make the decision lightly, my dog. Oh god. Why would you do this to me? Is it that valuable? Mm. Keep your distance from them as we make our way. Let's go. Hmm. Yes, we are doing it. Not the good, you motherfucker. <laughs> On your guard now, here it comes. Yes, we are doing it, of course. Can't see I kinda wish I didn't put this on hard. Fuck. You're either bloody bold or too confident for your own good. Just so we're clear. Slaying the things beyond you. Underestimating a dragon is the fastest way to get yourself killed. Yep, I know. I know. This one's on the smaller side oh. as dragons go. Oh. We might have a chance of driving <gasps> it off. Listen, yes. Keep an eye on it. I want that thing. Be ready for I'm kinda if with Galica with this one. Strike, I want that. <laughs> stand your ground and shield yourself. Do not waste your lives in a place like this. Now, let's go. We're on a mission. Uh, how strong are we really against it? No Fuck, it's this. fucking thick. Please don't do crazy damage. Don't attack. Fuck. And my healer's dead. Nice. Fuck. Gr Grease is a fucking... Wild motherfucker. Wait, I thought this said 50%, not 50 HP. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, we're not gonna go for the overpowered fucking dragon. What? Fuck you. Oh, 
Holy shit. Yup. It's a lost cause. There's nothing I can do at, at the moment. Hopefully the game like allows us to go back here at some point. Because as the prologue goes on, this is like, I don't think it's possible with the stuff we have. By the way, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I just know... Yeah, let's just get going. Phew, somehow we made it through. It was expecting the worst to happen. Well, it happened like at least twice. But thankfully, we live to see another day. We got the lucky this time. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Had that thing work and we'd be in a different situation. Uh, yeah. If you want to truly... What? Gauntlet's runner? Oh, our return! Good, 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 good. Okay, we can. The game already knew. Okay, good. You may as well wish for the mood. Only the most prominent nobles have this, uh, the means to secure a runner for themselves. Yes, nice, but can we move on? We're still done if that dragon wakes up. So let's not overstay our welcome. I just want this cave to finish. I'm kinda getting brain rots right now. <laughs> Look, isn't it the exit? Please, please, please. Don't be another boss fight. It is, we can finally get out of here. Looks like we can finally breathe. <laughs> okay, stop saying this kind of stuff. Something's gonna happen, right? Yeah, yeah, I fucking knew it. Oh no, could it be? No, it cannot be. Please, no. Uh oh. You're not gonna force us to fight it now, right? <laughs> Oh shit, okay. Oh, we're, we're playing uh, Subway Surfer. Cool. Can I sprint more? This is kinda easy. Okay, I'm sorry for saying this is kinda easy. Stop getting closer to the camera. Okay, good. <laughs> That's... <laughs> well... Actually, made it out, and in one piece, no less. <laughs> Can we get much higher? <laughs> so high. Speak for uh, yourself. I think that shaved a couple years off my life. Damn storm. Wouldn't be you'd be fine. You're already small enough. Delays, but we'll not be getting far in this torrent. We can make camp tonight and slip onto a Yes, please to make camp. Tomorrow, please. The wastes. We'll have to. If we want to make it in time. Public carriage seems a bit risky, doesn't it? Not with all the outsiders flocking in for the funeral. We'll be three faces among hundreds. Lovely. Another carriage ride. <laughs> Hopefully this one's smoother than the last couple. Let's just get our camp set up. Somewhere dry, preferably. <laughs> old man, do you see the weather? That's probably not dry, oh, old man. So Please. Cozy. <laughs> Alive again. It's certainly better than freezing. Reminds me of when I was a child. Back then, I wouldn't have been caught dead out in the wilderness like this. Countryside nobility like us had <laughs> I fell off, <laughs> guys. <laughs> My parents bowed and smiled for their money, and honestly, I despised them for it. Back then, I thought being a noble was about, I don't know, a life of prestige being respected but one spring seven years ago our town was attacked by this horrific creature a human though i had no idea at the time i was evacuated alongside <laughs> the servants while the rest of the town burned i waited for my parents to join us in the shelter but they would never come parents I'd so despised had stayed behind to protect the villagers who couldn't flee. Your parents were heroes. It changed everything. <laughs> it taught me who my parents really were, what it really meant to be a noble. But our town's just rubble now. A footnote in history. The human that destroyed us is all we'll ever be known for. 
I remember my father petitioning the capital for aid, but no reply came. Even knowing how much of a threat the humans were. Now, I think, what if the army... What if he's the one who abandoned us? If we were just... <sighs> hey, Grius. We all trust each other now, don't we? I think we can tell him. Aye. Maybe you're right. I'll admit the lad's sword put me in mind of the past. Something special about that sword? Well, we used it to identify the messenger from our faction. But it originally belonged to his highness. A kingly gift from his father. To better suit his highness and his keen aptitude for magic, that blade was specially forged with raw magla folded into the metal. Of course, when Swordplay bored him, he'd amuse himself by levitating it or standing atop it to glide about. <laughs> the royal rascal, that one. <laughs> what the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> Those days were all too short. Then, 12 years ago, it all came crashing down. I've heard. The prince was attacked, right? There was a plot on his life. One I wish I'd rooted out sooner. Just like tonight, it was pouring rain. Your Highness, this way! Ooh, enemy. It's about time. <gasps> the elf! The elf! Yes! My lord, are you hurt? Back. Please, please let her join our party. Well, that's how he became a plant. Freaking plant. <laughs> Just like that. Welp. I failed him. Again. <laughs> Again? Highness! Highness! <laughs> Do you want some fruits? <laughs> His Highness survived the attack, but... The curse hanging over him was powerful and complex. Of all the mage healers in the capital, not one could wake him. And he grew weaker with each passing day. We might lift the curse if we knew the specifics of its formula, but Luis would never give that up. Hmm. Which leaves but one way. <laughs> Kill him the fuck up. To dispel the curse, its caster must die. And you're sure Luis is the man you seek? Just imagine we kill him and nothing happens. He's like... <laughs> in the afterlife, ha, ha, ha. These fools. It was actually my plant that did that. <laughs> I saw him in the free. He was younger then. Younger even than you are now. And shorter besides. 
I could never mistake him. And now, after spilling the royal blood of father and son both, the people call him not traitor, but savior. For his highness, for the king, <laughs> the fuck? and for the very future of this country, he must be dealt with. To kill Luis is to see justice served. I see. So as he did with the prince, he would make of my city a stepping stone to further heights. A tool to spread the infamy of the humans. You haven't told that story to many, have you? Thank you for trusting me with it. A rogue never forgets. Bromes, come on. Even if it takes three generations, we'd see it repaid. But neither do we forget a grudge. And Luis will know that soon enough. So, that's what all this is about. Say, friend. <laughs> My means a lot to you too, doesn't it? Yes. Of course it does. You've been carrying a greater weight than I realized. In any case, I owe you my life. And we've both got something we'd fight to protect. Let's save this country. Together. Oh, ideally, once we're out of this cold. <laughs> I think it's about time we eat. We're almost to the capital, after all. I'd say that's worth celebrating. I'm beat. Finally. God... Damn it. Save this bitch up. Come on. How many hours is it now? Wow. Okay. I assure you it's much more than four hours and a half. <laughs> but sure. Anyway, that's a great time to stop. Every time we reach this campfire, it's always a good time to stop. <laughs> I guess. So yeah, let's uh, just get the fuck out. <laughs>